down here at the family farm and we had a water line break today and I want you to say hi to my sister's pigs. They're very friendly. <laughs> oh, oh, just flung mud all over me. <laughs> hey Jake. Hear that? They're pets. Screaming too. They're hungry. Brady, about time you join in. Down here, uh, Edgar, Nebraska, where I was born and raised, we had a water line break going to the house. My sister lives here. So, with the help of a bunch of people, on their day off, that's what farm life's all about. Everybody helps people. My younger brother's running that uh, trencher, and one of his employees, Leroy's the gearhead. We have so much mud here. I mean, it is terrible. Hey, Jameson. Yeah, shot was okay. It's, I've been going so long, baby. It's just shot for me. Got a lot of rain here in Nebraska, and then our frost went out, so everything is terrible. Putting this line in. My dad's up here, 75, and just, he don't stop. Can't make him stop either. Gary, you're right. I love helping people as well. And I wanna show you the goat here. And Callie playing. Callie, don't be mean to him. You wonder why he's butting you? Because he wants me off. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Thank you, Shannon. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm going to get one of those for calling coyotes. I'm going to... Oh! He's going to hurt you. He's fainting. No, oh. Chase, this is, uh, yeah, Edgar. You said it right there. Thanks, Brandon. <laughs> that puppy's cute. This is actually going to be a great, <laughs> this is a great, great Pyrenees, right? Yeah. Great game, great Pyrenees. This crazy thing is just cuter than all get out. This is Kimma's uh, new puppy. Henri, okay? Let me see if I can get that other one on here. <laughs> Thank you. Dean, this is the house I grew up in when I was a kid. It was my grandfather's home and grandmother's. And then when they moved to the town of Edgar, we actually uh, added on this front portion and then a basement underneath, 5,000 square feet. And it had uh, three, four, five, six, seven bedrooms, three bathrooms. 
my sister's living in it right now with her three kids and uh, her boyfriend from uh, Vegas. She come back to live here, so. Leroy running that, my younger brother. No, yeah, I'm, Cole, I protest a lot, you know. Trump, USA, I think those protesters ought to get what they deserve. And you don't even want to know what I say. Yeah, Stan, I, uh, I shot coyotes right off this farm. We used to raise some sheep. And uh, I actually killed coyotes that were killing the sheep. So that's how I started early in my life. Wow, she's rough. He hit something. Hey Tom, how are you? The Johnson Farm here. You can see Kimma's, uh, Kimma's daughter Callie playing with this crazy goat. This Billy. He is uh, playing mean. Yeah, you got that right, Mickey. I'm a supervisor. <laughs> she's gonna get what she's got coming, I think. What's the heaviest coyote I've killed? John, I killed a 67 pounder. I killed a 67 pounder in Alberta about five, six years ago. Well, tell your dad I said hi, Cole. <coughs> so you're talking on your phone? Yeah, I'm talking on my phone. <laughs> Give him a kiss. I'm trying, but he can't Yes, Joel, I made her home. William, I'd I'd love it if all I all I could do is just run around and hunt. I would absolutely love it. I love nothing more than just to hunt, but there's so much business I've got to attend to that it just wears me out. And it's fun being around family. I love being home. I don't know when I'll be through Utah again. Maybe this uh <laughs> Joe Irene, thank you. <laughs> Uh, hopefully Norm can see this. Uh, hopefully I can make it to Utah this uh, spring. I've, I've been out there to Vernal, Utah to do a, a show a couple years. Last year they didn't have the show because the oil industry was down so much and they, they canceled the whole show. So uh, no Jason, I have not uh, hunted wolves up there in uh, wherever you were from. I have hunted in Alberta. Hey there Brian. Hey Jake, I was thinking about maybe going to Lake of the Woods to ice fish. That's what I was wanting to do. Calling bobcats, wiggling the finger and lip squeak. Where'd that puppy go, Leroy? Do you know? Oh, there he is. Yeah. You better keep that thing up there, Callie. Keep keep the puppy up there. We'll go say hi to the puppy. This is a this is a great Pyrenees puppy. Cutest little thing. Say hi to everybody. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. She's trying to run away. Uh, yeah, I know it. Callie, that's my uh, that's my sister's girl. She's quite the. Quite the little farm girl, that's for sure. She loves it here. That's my dad, Raleigh. He, I should uh, be working instead of him. He's 75. Hey, Mariah. We're putting in this water line. It broke, and... Uh, 
there's quite a few people been helping today and that's kind of what farm life's all about i've been supervising i don't like to work <laughs> hey bobby bobcat contest huh that's pretty cool i'm gonna go show you my sister's pigs too hello alan that's John Combs right there from Superior, if anybody's watching from Superior, Nebraska. Hey, bossy! Bossy! <whistles> Boy, they really talk to you. They get excited. They think they're getting fed. Oh, listen to them. They'll eat that puppy. <laughs> hi! Hi! <laughs> hi! Watch out. <clears throat> Why are you videoing a lot? Huh? Why are you videoing a lot? Why am I videoing? Do we got do we need to go get some corn to feed them? We just feed them. When did you feed them? Uh, my first come on, day come there. on. You get in there, pup, and you'll get eight. Come on. Bacon. Josh, you're right. This farm life is pretty cool. Yeah, I bet they are, Dane. I need to make it out there. Get the puppy, Callie. Don't want to leave him out here or her out here. Those pigs will eat it. Anyway, just wanted to say hi and show you a little bit of the farm life. I'm going to let you guys go. Thank you all for joining. It's been nice. I feel good. Trump is in there. And uh, we are going to make America great. Might take some work. But at least there's already a step on Obamacare. And that's what I like. Hey, Dalton. Manual labor. Leroy and John getting with the program I love this I think I need to be supervisor more <laughs> get to going John come on there, all these superior got, people on here watching spade, spade they bread. know John works hard they know that <laughs> Dan it's uh, Edgar Nebraska is where it is that's where I was raised right there 5,000 square feet, seven bedroom, three bathroom. Uh, it was added on. It was my grandfather's house and grandmother's. And then when they moved to town, we moved into that probably when I was 12, 13 years old. So lived in a little shack a mile from here, right on a creek. So I swam in the creek, shot racing frogs, shot prairie dogs, hunted sparrows at night, you name it, I've done it, you know, growing up on the farm. So thank you all for joining. Have a wonderful day. See ya.